Okay, so I'm in my prayer room right now. And you guys know it's what has happened. Mis the missiles have been launched. And if you are not in prayer, you need to be in prayer. You need to be in the Bible. You need to be ready. Oh, sorry. Blood pressure's up just a little bit. So, hmm. Glorify the Lord. Now, you guys, hold on. Okay, brush your teeth. This is where I will be on. My lights are going to be on from now on. So I can come in here and I can say my prayers whenever I need it because it's going to be needed. We need to pray for our president. We need to pray for our men and women. We need to pray for the other countries that are part of this. We need to pray for it all. It all comes down to the reaction of Russia and other surrounding countries. Guys, hold on to your bootstraps. It's going to get messy and it's going to be rough. Believe in the Lord. Believe in Christ. Accept Him as your personal Savior. He died on that cross for your sins. He loves you. I love you. If nothing else fails, I'll meet you up in heaven. But until that time comes, be in the Word. Repent of your sins and ask the Lord to be your personal Savior. Accept Him as your Savior. John 3.16 For God so loved the world that gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believes in Him should not perish but have everlasting life. The only way to heaven is through Yosha, Jesus Christ. That's why he died on that cross. That's why we have the Bible. It's why we have Yahuwah, God. I'm, I'm just telling you guys. It's time. Because time is running out. This is not a scare tactic. This is reality. Because it's getting ready to happen. Only time will tell. We can't go by dates. You can't put a date on it. Because they expire. Until he's ready, be ready. Look in the heavens. Look up at the heavens. Looks like we'll be joining some people sooner than we thought we would. I love you guys. Stay in prayer. Read the Bible. Amen.